Hi, everyone, fam. What's happening? It's your girl, Ronna Lopez, a.k.a. Ronna the Virgo. I just dropped a brand new episode of the Virgo Viewpoint, and I want you to check it out. It's on Anchor, um, anchor.fm slash Orana's Virgo Viewpoint, A-A-R-O-N-A, um, Virgo Viewpoint, A-R-O-N-A-S. It's got an S on the end, Virgo Viewpoint. Um, it's available on multiple platforms, Google platforms, um, Google Podcasts, Apple Podcasts, and many more. I'm in the period of, um, I'm in the phase of rebuilding and, and transformation and rebranding. In fact, this entire YouTube channel is undergoing a makeover. Um, and I am healing from a lot of things like relationship drama, family drama, um, social drama. I mean, it is a lot. And today it got really heavy. It's a, uh, wow. This week is it's flying by, and I, I I sure did just do the um the podcast, and I put it up, and I, I said the um the <laughs> the zodiac uh traits were for uh, October 9th, and that was yesterday. <sighs> this stuff is just flying by, you guys. Um, I um I'm taking the score app. So that I can um, put my, um, so I can put my appointments and stuff together. <sighs> I just thought about it. This music in the background is gonna affect my video. No, I haven't found shelter yet, and that's actually the problem. The problem is, um, I called all those numbers and hotlines and all that shit. Um, trying to like locate housing and they would always play me. And so when I started taking it into my own hands of, you know, I bought me a tent and, you know, all that stuff, um, I was still getting hunted and harassed and followed by the police. Um, I was um, applying for jobs. I was applying, I applied for Chili's, I applied for Starbucks, uh, Wendy's. Taco Bell, and I wasn't getting hired by those places. Now, I'm not better than anybody, okay? I'm not, it's not about being better than nobody. But I definitely have the capacity to work better jobs and more prestigious jobs than those, but I was sucking it up and doing what I had to do, and I still wasn't getting hired. And so, it was like, well, why waste my time and energy on that? Number one, it's not really what I want to be doing. So, why waste a day or two or three or four or five going somewhere where I don't really want to be if I could just buckle down with my laptop and create my income stream like everybody else is doing. I mean, there's nothing different from what I'm trying to do with like YouTube and these other sites than what people are doing on Amazon and why it's an issue that that's what I'm doing. I have no idea, but I can't even care at this point. Like, People have, like, so harmed my safety, yo, that, like, it's it's really getting scary at this point. And that's another reason why I wanted to go live, because it's getting scary at this point. Um, I really love it. The fact that I got to go through all of this to prove it is ridiculous. It's, I mean, at this point, it's like, yo, well, fuck it. Like, I don't want to look like, do what you want. Like, I, I already didn't see what you, what you did do when you uh, had the opportunity to make different choices and you made the choices you made. So, okay, cool. I'm not in that way. Um, and then the other ex that I don't even talk to that I don't want to. The fact that he has been completely silent and completely off the radar, but apparently he's watching, has been crazy. Um, and today was the first day ever that I blocked him on Facebook. Um, I wasn't really paying attention to Facebook like that, um, especially my main page. I spent more time on my fan page. Um but then also, I spent more time on Instagram. Well, in recent days, within like the last, I don't know, six months, I really haven't been paying attention nor caring about who 
who is following me and what and all that, the, the whole follower game, I don't really care, haven't cared. And then before that, the things that I was going through were so serious. Um, I didn't have the, the time or the energy to go through, okay, well, who's on my page? Who has actually, like, if I wasn't seeing posts from you, I just wasn't worried about it or thinking about it. And my pages have more than 10,000, like, people, you know, so it's like, I'm not finna go through all that. If I don't see you on my timeline, out of sight, out of mind. But just because you out of sight, out of mind, don't mean that you ain't watching. And, um, that was the part that was problematic. And then today I did something about it and all of a sudden my Facebook got snatched. And I was like, for real? And then um, my my Twitter just got, I'm like, for real? I ain't did nothing on Twitter this entire time. I ain't following nothing but news, uh, news places. I'm reporting the news, I'm sharing my opinion. What the hell is going on? Like, for real? What's really happening? And then it's like, if I'm so boring and I'm so all of these negative things, why are people breaking their necks to follow me? Because I'm definitely not following them. I'm not making fake accounts to watch nobody. But there's all these fake accounts trying to troll and watch me. For what? Of course, that doesn't make me feel safe. And of course, that doesn't make me feel good. And it's like, this is what I got to go through to have love? From who? I don't want it. I'm good. Like, it ain't even about for it. It was dope because I didn't want nothing. Okay, so now YouTube is trying to mess up the signal. See, stuff like that. It's it's retarded. It's ridiculous. And then when I say that I am concerned for my safety, I get ignored. But it's fine. We're going to pretend that I am the problem to whoever, as I clearly have been just minding my business. People wouldn't even know where I was or what I was doing if they weren't watching my YouTube, listening to my podcast, or on my social media. No one has my number. No one. The only place where my number is uh, posted is like Twitter. Period. And because I got threatened, oh, we got to turn your phone off. Oh, you finna turn my phone off? Oh, okay. I'm just gonna get into the phone number. So you're trying to lock me on my Twitter. Okay, fine. I'm going to just get a new phone number. So, anyone? It's the Wi-Fi. That's the connection where you are. No, it's not. It don't have nothing to do with that. But it's cool. Anyway, check out the Virgo Viewpoint. Uh, Anchor.fm, Arana's Virgo Viewpoint. And I'm about to spend time putting this Patreon together and my book insights because tomorrow is the 11th. It's going to be that at midnight. So, and those were my goals that I was passionate about. Apparently, no one else cares about the things that I'm passionate about. And that's cool. It's fine. I'm going to just do it anyway because I'm passionate about it and it matters to me. So subscribe to the podcast. Subscribe to anchor.fm slash sex flicks and chill. Um, I'll figure out what time I'm going to bring it out. I'll figure it out. I'll let y'all know. Um, I need some time to myself to figure out other things. So I'll let y'all know. Thanks for tuning in. Thank y'all for stopping by the channel. I hope you guys have subscribed. It's www.youtube.com slash C slash A-A-R-O-N-A-L-O-P-E-Z. If y'all gonna be on here, subscribe so y'all can get the notifications of when I drop new videos and new posts. And hopefully everybody's here on the up and up, not on some other stuff. We don't need that. (laughs) All right, y'all. Peace. Wait, it's always the awkward pause at the end. Okay, here we go. Oh, wait, one more time. And sing. Hey, y'all, it's Lucky. Here is the recording of the comment section from Marana's live that y'all just previously watched. She did go back through and delete every single comment that I did post. So I figured I would provide y'all with this recording that I did manage to have and save before um, she did delete them. But if y'all haven't subscribed, please do so.